So we're looking at the Sermon on the Mount because we want a house that doesn't fall over. And we're, we've seen how Jesus says, blessed are you, uh, the poor in spirit, those who are longing for righteousness, those who are merciful. Uh, he's blessing those people who are seeking something different because theirs is the kingdom of heaven. And then he says, you're the salt of the earth. And I just want to bless you and want you to talk about today how you are making life taste better for people. What you're doing that is making a difference. Uh, we had a video on Sunday from Sam. We uh, just constantly talking about how we're influencing our neighbours, our friends, our family, our workplaces for the kingdom of God. And, and it's just an opportunity to, to recognise that with the salt of the earth, making things taste better. Uh, maybe you're you're a bit uh, challenged on Sunday about the whole stopping the rot thing. Maybe you are the, uh, uh, you know, all the marriages in your family have, have fallen apart or, or there's such a toxic environment in your workplace and you want to see it changed or, or things are just going downhill in your neighbourhood and, and there's a way, there's, there's, the onus is on you to stop that because you're the salt of the earth to, the, to preserve stuff. Although I really don't think that's the primary meaning of the text. When it says you're the salt of the earth, I think it means salt as a fertiliser, which isn't used a lot nowadays, but we still put Epsom salts on plants and stuff. Uh, but there's a uh, there was an understanding that salt causes good things to grow. And of course, that's what we're here for. The creation ordinance was to make good things grow and, uh, you know, to work the land and care for it. And and so we're, we're here as salt of the earth causing good things to grow. And it's just an opportunity to look back on the last few weeks or maybe this year and say, what have I caused to grow? What, what around me is now grown up? That is, is there because I'm the salt of the earth, uh, allowing others to flourish, letting letting a good environment grow, children grow into the fullness of who they are. Um, the the way that we can grow profits or grow a company or or just grow the mental health of the people around us. So have a think about these three areas of salt, uh, and and bring some examples of. Times that you've made life taste better, times when you've stopped the rot, and times when you've caused good things to grow. And I pray that as you look outwards, that you'll have a really good prayer time as you pray about each other's influence. Uh, we've been praying a lot, haven't we, for the Jabez prayer. Lord, increase my influence. And uh, may that be so in Jesus' name. See you in a bit. Bye-bye.